What's up, guys? I'm here with Zartan from the G.I. Joe um, Retaliations line. And I'm going to have to say that this is the most G.I. Joe-like figure out of the whole line. Because he comes with all accessories. No stupid-ass rocket launcher gimmick kitty crap comes with. Bow and arrow. A sheath with a sword, with another sword that goes in the sheath, and it attaches to his back. Comes with a gun. Comes with three switchable heads, which makes it four heads total. And this thing that pops off. Oh, and he comes with arrows that goes on his back. This thing pops off. I should have took this off and seen how it came off before I you know, did this review. Because I don't think this side pops off. I think it just comes off the one side somehow. Give me your mess. Zartan. How's it come off? Yeah, only one side pops off, so you gotta like kind of pull it somehow. There it goes. I'll just take his head right off with the mask, I guess. There you go. Alright. Pop this head out if you want. He's got light piping too on three of the heads. He's got a Zartan head with green light piping. Um I don't, I'm not sure whose head this is, but it's got red light piping. You got a storm shadow head with red light piping, and then you got a snake eyes head with no light piping. But it's cool because the snake eyes mask um, kind of got like his visor got like little fangs, so it kind of looks like a snake. I don't know if the regular snake eyes figure does that. Let me see. No, he doesn't. He just got the regular visor. Let me focus back in there. Um, let's put Snake Eyes head up there. Oh yeah. Um, like I said, you can put the sheath on the back. Now you got that. And you can put your swords in there. Um, he got decent articulation. They just didn't do the double knee joint or the ankle. Um, everything else is standard G.I. Joe, I think. Because they never had a bicep swivel. But they have this. He does have rotating wrists. I know the ninjas have um, hinged wrists where they rotate and f go back and forth. They have the best articulation out of all the figures. But he's, they have the ab. Oh, they don't have waist either. I don't... G.I. Yeah, Joe's had waist. Yeah, I believe so. I can't... It's been a while since I stopped collecting them, so I can't remember. I don't have any old G.I. Joe figures around either. Wait, that's a lot. Yes, I do. Let's see. They're not old, old, but they're just renegade ones. Thirtieth anniversary, but they'll do. Um, no, they just have the the ab crunch, but they do have the double knee, and they have that's nice articulation. I mean, why couldn't they just make them like these ones? I love these figures. 30th wave. 30th anniversary figures were great. Couldn't keep collecting though, man. I had too many things going on. I, mean, I was collecting G.I. Joe. I was collecting everything. everything. I didn't have enough room and I was wasting too much money. I had to sell it all. But yeah. Anyway. He is like the most G.I. Joe figure from the line. Because he's... Mostly like that, you know, he comes with a bunch of accessories, and he has some pretty decent articulation. All you gotta do is unscrew his legs, get a get a set of legs that look like his, and you can fix the leg articulation. I'm gonna start doing the throw them up on eBay, maybe it'll work, maybe make some money. But yes, that is a uh, Zartan, I'll show you with the snake eyes head. And they, they look zombified too, so you can tell it's not really snake eyes. And this head. That head looks really tiny on the body. I don't know. Got good detail though. Like in the suit and stuff, it's pretty decent. Not a bad figure. I'd say if you're going to do this, get snake eyes. Uh, Storm Shadow and him are definitely uh, the first three to get out of all of them. Then you get a uh, Cobra Commander. And then this guy too. Black Cobra Commander, if you can find him. 
and this dude's pretty decent too. He comes with a parachute. It's actually like a real cloth parachute, and this he just got his staff that shoots a missile, so it's not bad. Yep, yeah, that's that for uh this gay guy over here. Take it easy.